When we were children, my parents used to take us to Pacific Square Marketplace in Gardena every once in a while to, assumedly, stock up on Japanese groceries. I have surprisingly little recollection of the grocery store, but what I do remember, because obviously it's the most important part, was stopping by the little Japanese confectionery a few doors down on every trip. They had mochi and manju and all sorts of Japanese sweets, and they'd always let us each choose one as a treat. They were all so tempting. The hiyoko manju shaped like a little brown bird, or my mom's trusty anpan, or the green ones dusted with kinako that looked so mysterious at the time, but I would later learn to love. But every single time, I would fall back on my trusty favorite, the pink and green striped suama mochi. In many ways, it was the most boring one there. Colorful, but no fillings or flavorings. But even to this day, there's just something special about that pink and green striped mochi.